What makes these dishes so German? Ah, oh, potatoes? Why potatoes? Well, Germans simply love them. They crop up in many traditional dishes. And weirdly enough, potato is often used as a slang term to describe Germans themselves. Although some do take this as a bit of an insult. But when it comes to the ways that potatoes are grown, cooked and eaten, there are certain rules. This is Germany after all. So let me give you the lowdown. First things first, we have to clear something up. Even though Germany sees itself as the land of the potato, the potato did not in fact originate here, but rather in the Andes in South America. The potato came to Europe in the 16th century, but it took some time before there was large scale cultivation in Germany. Some 270 potato varieties of about 5,000 known worldwide are approved for planting in Germany. Most of them have feminine names like Belana, Gala and Linda. Some people say they were named after the farmer's daughters. If you're ever visiting Germany, here are some potato dishes you need to try. Roast potatoes, mashed potatoes, potato fritters, and of course, potato salad. Potato salad with Vienna sausages. It hardly gets any more German than that. To some, it's even the obligatory dish for Christmas Eve dinner. The average German eats around 56 kilos of potatoes every year. That's about 280 servings, a lot of potatoes. To give you an example of just how much Germans love potatoes, my German grandmother sent me a whole package of them in the post from her own garden. Germany harvests the highest number of potatoes in the EU and even ranks sixth in the whole world. Not bad, right? Let's take a closer look. Every year on his family farm near Berlin, Sebastian Klaas harvests loads of potatoes and sells them in his own farm store. So he knows which potatoes the Germans like best. Well, general speaking, in Germany, they love the very dark yellowish potato. In other countries, they want or they have them in white or very pale colour. We've got one sort, it's actually red on the outside and it's dark yellow in the inside and that's Laura. And what's your personal relationship to potatoes? I really enjoyed uh, farming with potatoes. It's a lot of fun and also this digging them out is like chasing gold nuggets. That sounds like something everyone should try once. My first one Normally, a machine would do the work, but here the first ripe potatoes are painstakingly harvested by hand in early summer. Then they're sorted and packed into boxes. When the potato first arrived in Europe over 400 years ago, it wasn't very popular in Germany. Not many farmers knew how to harvest it. Some even ate the plant's toxic blossoms. In the mid 18th century, King Frederick II tried to encourage planting the new crop with his potato orders, but had little success. But the image survives and potatoes are still laid on his grave. The German word for them, Kartoffel, comes from the Italian word for truffle. Both grow hidden in the ground. Over the past 70 years in Germany, potato consumption has been dropping in favor of rice and pasta. In case you find yourself invited to a German household for dinner, here are some very important potato-related words for you. Kapu or Kartoffelpu. This is the shortened version for mashed potatoes, which is very often used by children. Nelig und festkochend. Floury and firm. This refers to the different types of potatoes because you can't use every potato for every dish. Pommes or Fritten. Short form for pommes frites, which is French fries. Now that we've learned so much about them, it's time to finally eat some potatoes. I'm meeting someone who knows how to prepare them in the most delicious way. As a head chef, Nico Blumel knows potatoes. So how do Germans prefer them? Einfach klassisch die gekochte Kartoffel. Ein bisschen Butter geschwenkt mit Kräutern und Salz und das 
geht am meisten. Ich glaube, gleich danach kommt die Stampfkartoffel oder Kartoffelpüree. Worauf muss man achten, wenn man Kartoffeln zubereitet? Ganz wichtig ist, dass man die im kalten Wasser ansetzt. Also nicht warten, bis das Wasser kochen, dann reinmachen, weil dann werden die immer matschig. Und auch darauf achten, weil es gibt mehlig kochende Kartoffeln, die werden weich beim Kochen. Und die festkochenden, die werden halt fest beim Kochen. Also die benutzt man dann für die Bratkartoffeln und für Suppen oder Kartoffelstampf, die für mehlig kochenden Kartoffeln. Well, there you have it. The world of the potato in Germany. I had so much fun harvesting them for the first time today. And now I have even more respect for the hard work that goes into them. But do you even like potatoes? Let us know in the comments. <laughs>